Welcome friends, uh, I trust that you are enjoying this study about entering God's presence. Today we will learn a little bit more about what we do in God's presence. Let me first read for us from Romans, Romans chapter 12 verses 1 through 2. It says, I beseech you therefore brethren by the mercies of God that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy acceptable to God which is your reasonable service and do not be conformed to this world but be transformed by the renewing of your mind that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. As we consider the uh, old sanctuary and the practices of worship we had um, people of God bringing in sacrifices and offerings to God and that's how it's always been even if you look at uh, a, a child of God encountering the presence of God there was an altar made there was worship there there was an offering there was a sacrifice now we who are part of the new covenant and enjoy God's presence unhindered uh, and uh, you know uh, with, with great access, what kind of sacrifices are we expected to bring into God's presence? Here's what we read from Romans 12. We are supposed to offer our bodies as a living sacrifice. Now, God is asking for something greater than what the people of the old covenant had to offer. We are called to dedicate ourselves completely and the scripture tells us that we must offer our bodies as an act of worship. Now, what does that mean? It means that in everything that we do, we consider our body sacred we consider whatever we do with our body holy and dedicated unto the lord and that is an offering and that is a sacrifice to god now uh, the new testament does not just stop there there are many other passages i'm just going to quote uh, a couple of them uh, in first peter chapter 2 and verse 5 hebrews 13 verses 15 and 16 there are other offerings that we are encouraged to bring in god's presence and these include our praise our worship these include our good deeds that we can do in the name of Jesus and for the name of Jesus and also the giving that, that we do um, to uh, glorify God and to help those who are in need. So we do not offer physical sacrifices anymore but when we encounter the presence of God, this is what God requires of us that we offer our bodies as a living sacrifice to God. Bring Him our worship, bring Him our praises, bring Him our good deeds and also dedicate all the giving that we do for His glory. As a church and as a family, can we do that? Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you that God, you have paid the ultimate price and the greatest sacrifice for our salvation. And Lord, as we enjoy your presence, God, we bring these spiritual sacrifices to you, Lord. And Father, we ask, Lord, that you will bless each one of them, Father. And Lord, that we will have more and more of your presence. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.